Hey everyone, it's Mike. Uh, just wanted to give everyone an update on what's going on with That's Not Funny. We have started working on the movie. We've had a couple big meetings about it. Uh, we're talking about what the next big steps are going to be. Last night I even started writing the opening narration of the movie, which uh, it's kind of a personal anecdote about comedy that I think uh, felt appropriate to me. Um, another thing is uh, we've got our postcards in the mail. Check them out there. Mm. Uh, I filled out a bunch of them this morning and I'm actually on my way to the post office to mail all them out. Um, so the first 25 of you will be receiving the postcards. I'll start walking here. Um, but some of you have selected a reward that included a personalized shout out on the YouTube page. So I'm going to go through those here while I'm walking. You can kind of get a taste of my neighborhood here in Hollywood. Um, and again, these are the people who uh, selected the uh, $100 or more uh, pledge reward. The first one is a guy named Anders Ikermo. And his message was, To Amy, the world's greatest librarian. Okay. Um, Tony Santiago, a longtime friend of the family. Um, friends with my dad forever. He says, there's nothing funnier than watching Lynn getting carried off the beach. That's what you call an inside joke. That I, I don't even get that one. But uh, I'm sure people will. Uh, Evan Lewis says, anything can be funny. Just very few people are funny. And I would agree with that, I think. Uh, Robert James Guerin, he is the dad of my creative partner, Robert Guerin, and he just says, good luck, and, and we thank him for that. Um, a gentleman named Howard Daughters, who's been a big supporter of ours, he says, visit funny2.com for some more humor, and uh, go, go there and check out his site, he gave us some money. Um, a gentleman named Noel Smith says, Snickers is the best dog ever. I must, must have taken some kind of poll. Uh, Karen Ann Strohmeyer and her husband David Strohmeyer, who were in our last documentary, The Last Days of Cinerama, um, they say, support funny, and that's an idea I can get behind. Uh, a gentleman named Bob Abrahams. He just says, open parentheses, close parentheses, and I imagine that's some kind of code. Cedric, or Cedric, Murray says, thank you. Jesse V. Hill, a guy I've known for a long time, says, say whatever is in your heart, Mike, whatever is in your heart. And uh, if Jesse knows me at all, and I think he does, what's in my heart is hobo tears Andrew Jones another guy I've known since college if this is the Andrew Jones I'm thinking of uh, he says thanks to Andrew Jones so I'm saying thanks to Andrew Jones uh, a guy named Benjamin Radford says thanks to writer and investigator Benjamin Radford for his support Uh, Rick Castaneda, another guy I've known for a while, another filmmaker. He made a movie called Cement Suitcase. You should check it out if you get the chance. Um, he says, and hello to writer-director Rick Castaneda. Keep on keeping on. Friend of man. Let's go to the next page here. Okay, um... John Powers, he says, for me to say, special thanks to my cousin John Powers. He's a comic in New York who will be on Letterman soon. Now, he didn't give me a date as to when that will be, but uh, check your local TV listings. 
Um, but yeah, that's that's my cousin John. You can, if you live in the greater New York area, you can visit the city of New York and, and see him do stand-up there. Um, Nelson, now I've never been able to pronounce his last name, but I think it's Nelson, either Jovel or Hovel or Yovel, one of those. Nelson, I apologize. Uh, he says, stay black, Mike, and I will. I always do. Robert Ritchie says, asterisk, no shout-out requested. So, I think I should respect his wishes on that. Uh, Anthony Nicolo, Tony Nicolo, another friend of the family. And he says, hey, you can't fool me. There is no such thing as a sanity clause, which is a quote from a movie called The Godfather. Um... James Andreessen says hugs and tussles. Kenneth Riqua, another buddy of mine, he just wrote a, a long dash in the space for the YouTube shout out message. So I don't know how to interpret that. And then Ivan Infante, a, a friend and ex coworker of mine, he says shout out. And that's the last one of the people who selected that reward and gave us uh, information. There are some other people I'd like to mention by name. Um, my mom, Susan Milney. My uncles, Michael and Joe Milney. My aunt, Nancy Austin. Um, the Lion Pride, or family, uh, who, they're my girlfriend's parents and, and family. They're very supportive. My longtime uh, best friend Christian Brennan and his boyfriend Jovi, who uh, gave us a, <clears throat> a nice donation. Somebody named Diva Etchison, who donated but didn't fill out the survey. Uh, my friend John Ross, very good friend of mine. Rachel Slocomb, who I've known for a while. Asa Shumskis Tate, who I've known forever, and somebody who has put in their name as just Chris. Just Chris. Again, all these people gave us quite a bit of money. Some of them didn't fill out the survey. Some of them opted for no reward, but I wanted to mention them anyway. And of course, I want to thank each and every person who uh, pledged and donated any amount of money to the movie. We literally couldn't be doing this without you. Really, really means everything to me. And uh, my creative partner, Rob, who is um, producing the movie with me. And uh, he will be editing the movie with me as well. Um, I think the movie's uh, it's shaping up to be a little bit different than what I originally planned when we wanted to get the 50000 for the first uh, campaign. But... With the, the money that we got, which we're very, very thankful for, uh, the plan has kind of changed a little bit. It's going to be a little bit more of a personal story, I think, but in a good way. Um, in a way, I think the limitations are going to help it out, and it's going to feel a little bit more heartfelt, maybe, than uh, what the original plan was. Um, that's pretty much it. Uh, I'll keep posting video updates about the movie and you can uh, just keep track of me here you can uh, follow me on Twitter at at Mike Celestino or uh, follow the movie on Twitter at at that's x not x funny and um, we'll keep in touch and we'll keep you posted I think it's going to be good it's it's um it's probably going to be a bit longer, actually, than the half hour that I said in the second campaign. Or at least it's shaping up that way. We'll see. We'll see what happens. The important thing is the movie's getting made, thanks to you guys. Couldn't be more appreciative. And um, I'm almost at the post office here, another couple blocks. And I'll be sending out the first batch of postcards, so look for those in the mail. Uh, if you're not in the first 25, you'll probably get yours very soon 
I'll see you later. This is Mike Celestino reporting live from Selma in Hollywood. Have a good one.